Okay, this is part two in our crowd control uh, simulation. Um, it's important to remember to save control S. Uh, crowd control. I already have a crowd control set up. I'm not going to say, well, okay, you know what? I will save this. Uh, crowd control tutorial. Sim. And we'll call this. Okay, so now what we'll do is um, toggle our layers manager. And again, usually I have all these off to the right side of my screen. And you bastards out there that need tutorials mess up my whole gig when I got to bring things up here. Okay, so we'll select our arrow, which is uh, inside the default zero layer. And we're going to create a new layer. And we're going to call it base and, <laughs> and this check mark right here lets us know that whatever we create is going to happen on that layer. So we want to check the base or the default zero layer. And we'll close this. Let's move this up a little bit. Okay, what we're going to do now is create a ground plane. Uh, one and one. Ten thousand. We will zero it out. We'll call it ground plane. And we'll pick a color more, or I guess less retina searing. I'm going to hit M to bring up my material editor. I'm going to give it, well, I'll just color it the same thing. Now we can hit this button, it's a sign material button, or we could drag it right onto the object. And even that's bright. So I just drag this one and we will darken it and close that. All right, so we have our ground plane. And what we want now is a a plane for our particles to move on. So I'm going to create another plane. We will make this thousand by a thousand. Raise this up. Zero it out. Thirty. We will call this particle plane. I call it a particle place. Particle plane is what we want though. And we will assign this to that. It's not, not important for this kind of thing. On the keyboard, I would hit the shortcut 6 to bring up our particle flow. This way, I'll show you. Underneath standard primitives, we have particle systems. I want PF source. Okay, uh, and we could, well, the first thing I always do is uh, click to 100 so we know exactly what particles we're working with. Click on particle view, it brings up our standard tree. We don't want that. The standard tree is usually good for nothing. Uh, shrink this down. And we will put a birth 
a position object uh, speed by surface shape instance and uh, well that's all we'll put in for now okay good so we'll wire this up blow and move this over here actually okay emitter start zero this is all default right now we're gonna play around with a bunch of options here position object we want to pick the arrow plane so by list or particle plane I guess it's called so we have that uh, da, 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 da. now we can just uh, well, we can separate everything well no we'll just leave it like this okay hide hide that and back to our layers and take the base arrow layer and hide that as well oh no I guess we shouldn't yet because we haven't selected it alright our shape instance base arrow okay now we'll hide this close that and display bounding boxes speed along surface unhide by name speed by surface you want to use particle plane Now we can scrub a little bit and we can zoom out and we'll see all these bounding boxes. These boxes represent the arrows. There's a couple things to note here is that um, A, they're flying up. We don't want that. We want them to travel along the, the uh, particle plane. So we will make sure speed by surface is highlighted. We want parallel to surface so they stay parallel to that another thing we might notice is that they're all oh first of all we might notice that there's a shitload of them let's, let's pick up let's do 10 for now uh, 0 set that to actually set that to negative 10 set both of to negative 10 no make that 0 Okay, zero, and, uh, sorry, the video seems choppy a little bit, it's because I have to keep checking to see where the 10 minute mark is, YouTube doesn't allow you to go over 10 minutes, so I, I'm going to have to break this, this section up here, so, um, we will handle these issues in part two, well, well, yeah, this is section two, part one, so section two, part two will be up next.